linking words. Consequence. So, in the last video, we talked about addition, right? When we're going to add something to our sentence. In this video, we're going to talk about consequence. So, when we're linking a sentence, we point as a consequence. A consequence is something that happens as a result. So, if you do this, because you did that, this happened. Something happens. Cause and effect. That is a consequence. So, we have words that will link other situations together. To link. Bring them together. So, the first word we'll talk about, as a result. As a result of you doing bad in school, we're going to help you. We're going to give you a tutor. As a result of you drinking tea, you feel energized because of caffeine. Thus is the next word. If you spend too much time thinking, thus, you'll be in too much thought. Thus. Thus is usually used in literature, normally old literature. It's not commonly used in speech, at least in the United States. Thus. Thus, we will go to the store. We need groceries, thus, we must go to the store. It's more of older English. We don't use it that much anymore. It's more of a fancy kind of word. Okay. So, that's common. It's more informal. Uh, okay. I dropped my marker. So, I'm going to pick it up. All right. So, the grass is green. So, I smell it. I don't know. <laughs> Therefore, that's another common one. You can use this more in a paragraph when you're explaining something in more detail. Um, and you need to be more concise. So, okay, for example, I was tired. Therefore, I went to bed. I went to sleep. Therefore, I went to sleep. I'm hungry. Therefore, I'm going to eat. Okay. Consequently, all right, now you're in trouble. You're in big trouble. So consequently, you're going to have to pay for your crime. Consequently, you have to pay for your crime. You did something. So now you have a consequence, right? You did something. So cause and effect as a result you have to pay the consequence. Then we have the word thereby. Once again, thereby, it's not very common. Normally this is used by, in a very, more of a formal sense, okay? You have not done your homework. Thereby, you are grounded. Normally that's how you hear it, okay? When people say it like that, thereby, I am the king. <laughs> eventually, we have the word eventually. That means later, okay? It means eventually, in the future, this will happen because... Because we do not take care of our planet, eventually there will be global warming. If you eat bad, eventually you're going to be fat. <laughs> eventually. Eventually. Eventually, I'm going to be old. You can't hide. Eventually. Then. 
Now we have the word then. If you don't like spaghetti, then I'm going to clean it up. That's a bad example. Then, right? So then is like saying, if you don't do this, then I'm going to do this, right? It's a consequence. Then I'm going to do this. Or if you're cleaning, I'm going to clean my room. Then I'm going to clean the kitchen. Then I'm going to clean the kitchen. And then the last words that I have, in that case. So when you say something, usually maybe in an argument with another person, or not an argument, or a debate, or maybe you're talking to somebody about a situation. In that case. Oh, they removed the table from the break room. In that case, I'm going to have lunch in my room. Oh, they said I cannot use the soccer field. In that case, I'm going to play basketball. Okay, do you see the difference in there? Each of these words is always a cause and effect. As a result, something happened, therefore, therefore, you do something else as a consequence. Some things happen, and then something happens because of that. So that is why we studied linking words and the consequence. So we want to link something together. We want to link two points together in a consequential manner. So we have the following words, as a result, thus, so, therefore, consequently, thereby, eventually, then, and in that case. So these are most of the linking words that we have. Thank you. Thank you for watching. Let me know in the comments what you think about the consequence words. Also, you can practice in the comments. Write a few sentences. I challenge you to write a few sentences using some of these words so you can practice too. Um, if you enjoyed today, please consider subscribing. Thank you for watching. Have a nice day. Goodbye.